in amongst the balls and he can break Bill with the best of them. Struck that one pretty well. I was obviously hoping the only red he could leave was that one. He has left a cutback, but this is dangerous shot so early on. Cue ball's going to be going into the pack. No real 100% idea where the cue ball's going to end up. Be hoping to finish on the black. Well, is it a bonus? Is the pink going? Well, I believe it does go. Couldn't have wished for anything better than that. Clearly does. Inch perfect on it. Give me a second, please, Ronnie. Be also interesting to see how well Ronnie plays today. I think it was last year the quarter final when he beat Ricky Walden in an hour and hardly missed a pot. So perhaps his first round was where he wasn't at his best, was sort of just getting used to the surroundings, and then today will he take off? Seven. Incredible arena, incredible atmosphere to play a match in. Eight. Not quite as planned, that. Always knew he had this red near the right corner. And he's, although he's a fair yeah. distance away, 13. he's got a nice angle on this red. Doesn't have to do much with the cue ball. No, and if he chooses just to stun this, watch how easily he hits it. You would think to stun for the black, you'd have to hit it hard. Watch the amount of effort that goes into this shot. Hardly hit 14. it. That's just timing. Yes, I've heard you say many times, Stephen, that the thing is with that, if you deaccelerate as you're going through the ball, then that's a tough shot. But if you cue it nicely as you cued that, you get nicely through the cue ball, you don't have to hit it hard to get the reaction. Not on these super fine cloths. 21. Well, certainly play for this red to the left Stitching. middle. He may have been thinking about one to the left corner, but he'll settle for this. As every player knows, very important to get a good start in a match. Get your hand on the table. I don't care who you are, you just need to settle and calm yourself down. And this arena and the majority of these people have come to see him perform. And he knows that, he's aware of that, and that brings its own little bit of pressure. Coming round this side, it was going to give him a choice of at least two reds. 26. But didn't want that cue ball so close to the cushion. Procuring, stroked it in as though it was over the pocket. John, I thought it's a certainty he was going to beat my record today, but I thought it might make me wait a bit longer. It's looking ominous already. 42. Yeah, he looks in good touch. 
I think as in the, in the best player in the world, you're, you're up for occasions like this. 50. And you do find your touch immediately. That's what separates the, the great from the good. Fifty one. Yes, and it wouldn't have gone past on his attention that Marco played <coughs> so well in his last match, particularly making the one four seven. So he knew he had to be on his game right from the off. Fifty nine. Sixty-six ahead. Sixty-six. Pop this red and a colour. And that would do it. And this is 67. just what you want. Win the frame in one visit. Nice angle on the blue now to go into the that little cluster of reds. Quick glance at the scoreboard. Sixty-seven points in front. So just the blue needed. Well, Chance to Cannon, but he's played a perfect positional shot on the red. There you see it, 72 points ahead. 72. Just 67 remaining. The perfect start. Seventy-three. Maybe he doesn't have to play the cannon. Well, he did play the cannon. And it's worked out beautifully. So don't forget, 80. If he 81. makes the century here, he will be the all-time record century break maker. It will be break number 776. Eighty-eight. Eighty-nine. Well, Stephen, I'll let you call this home. Yeah, it's been an immaculate start. It really hasn't been 96. in doubt from very early on. Every shot has been cued to perfection. Is this a tricky one? Nope. Ninety-seven. I think the red does pot to the left middle. A little delicate shot in the brown of the cushion in behind the red. Stephen said he didn't keep him waiting long. 776 career centuries and well worth a standing ovation. And even Marco clapping, absolutely sensational from one of the most natural talents that's ever played the game. He wins the first frame, by the way. It's 1-0. <laughs>